welcome students so today we are going to discuss about computational approaches to problem solving in module 4 so what is computational approaches to problem solving appo nammal oru problem te resolve cheyan vendite nammal endu in systematic allengil algorithmic aayittu data driven methods ne involve cheyipikkunnathana computational approaches to problem solving nu parayunnathu അപ്പൊ ഈ ടെക്നിക്കിനായിട്ട് ടെക്നിക്കിനകത്ത് മെയിൻ ആയിട്ട് നമ്മൾ എന്ത് ചെയ്യുന്നു കോംപ്ലക്സ് പ്രോബ്ലംസിനെ നമ്മൾ എന്ത് ചെയ്യുന്നു മാനേജബിൾ പീസസ് ആയിട്ട് ബ്രേക്ക് ഡൗൺ ചെയ്തിട്ട് എന്ത് ചെയ്യുന്നു നമ്മൾ ആ ആ പ്രോബ്ലത്തെ സോൾവ് ചെയ്യാൻ വേണ്ടിയിട്ടുള്ള സൊല്യൂഷൻസിനെ എന്ത് ചെയ്യുന്നു ജനറേറ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നു അപ്പം ഇതിനകത്ത് നമ്മൾ ഒരുപാട് സ്ട്രാറ്റർജീസ് യൂസ് ചെയ്യാറുണ്ട് അപ്പൊ അതിൽ ഉള്ള ഡിഫറെൻറ്റ് സ്ട്രാറ്റജീസിൽ ഫസ്റ്റ് വൺ ആണ് ബ്രൂട്ട് ഫോഴ്സ് സെക്കൻഡ് വൺ ഈസ് ഡിവൈഡ് ആൻഡ് കോൺകർ third one is dynamic programming greedy algorithms and randomized approaches so first one is brute force approach so now let us discuss about what is brute force approach to problem solving so brute force approach nu parayunnathu etum basic aayittulla straight forward aayittulla method aanu problems ne solve cheyan venditulla etum basic aayittulla method aanu appo ivide endha cheyunnu vechchal ella possible aayittulla solutions ne nammal endu cheyunnu test cheyunu until the correct one is found in brute force approach we are testing all possible solutions until the correct one is found while it guarantees finding the solution if one exists it is often inefficient due to its exhaustive nature it relies on trying every possible combination to find the correct result this approach is commonly used in scenarios where the solution space is small simplicity is preferred over efficiency no better algorithm is readily available ee situations lokke ayilakke ayirikku nammal ee approach prefer cheyunnathu so characteristics of root fault solution exhaustive search simplicity inefficiency guaranteed solution these are the characteristics of brute force solutions so now let us discuss about a, an example uh, of uh, brute force approach okay, the example is forgotten password scenario so uh, suppose you forget the password to your four digit numerical lock appo nammala nammude or four digit numerical lock inde password nammal marannu poi ennu vekkuga appo nammude problem nu vechuyinjale the lock has a combination of four digits ranging from 00009999 resulting in 10000 possible combination so in brute force approach you systematically try each possible combination starting from 0000 0001 0002 and so on until the correct combination is found so the worst case is that you might have to test all 10000 combinations the best case is that you might get lucky and find the correct combination on the first try so now let us discuss about the uh, program so this is the program for the forgotten password define uh, brute force password correct password so first step is that loop through all possible four digit combinations 00029999 then for i in range 10000 so format the uh, number to ensure it is always four digits example 0010234 then attempt this equal to stri dot is it fill 4 so that is we at uh, uh, we at uh, this function takes the correct password as an argument and iterates over all possible four digit combinations and each number is formatted to ensure it's always four digits using the is it fill 4 method the function prints each attempt and checks if it matches the correct password then testing the correct password 
so you can uh, change the value of correct password to any four digit password you want to test so actually this program simulates a brute force search and will find the correct password by checking each possibility one by one so we have to keep in mind that this method is inefficient for longer passwords or more complex systems. So the program successfully found the password 1234. So this result demonstrates that the brute force approach systematically checks all possible combinations until it defines the correct one.